Hey guys, what's going on? Ben Polly97 here, back with another video review. This is a little re-review of the uh, Legacy Megazord reissue because that Megazord was pretty ter that Megazord uh, review was pretty terrible. So I decided to uh, do a re-review it, review it again. So uh, feel free to come and say you already reviewed this. I know, but I need I needed to do a review a uh, re-review on this because. Because I'll, I didn't have a tripod yet, so let's get a let's do a re-review on it. Let's get started with the packaging real quick. Put this over here to the side real quick. Let's start it on the packaging. Um, it, the packaging is really cool looking. Let's not get it wrong. The packaging is awesome, awesome, awesome looking. So um, you got a picture of the Megazord. Um, all colorful. Um, picture of the Megazord, picture of the five Zords that comes with it. Bandai 15 Plus, diecast and paint, diecast parts. Stats of the Megazord. Try not to hit the camera. Uh, the story, I'm pretty sure you already. Seriously, he doesn't know the story, Tim, and PR. A uh, picture of the five rangers and five teenagers with attitude are recruited to protect the Earth against the evil Rita Repulsa, led by the Rogue Zordon. They receive superpowers. Oh, I love that. And... The top. Picture of the Megazord. And let's check out the backside. So, uh, Tyrannosaurus Dinosaur, Pterodactyl Dinosaur, Mastodon Dinosaur, Saber Tooth Tiger Dinosaur, and Triceratops Dinosaur. Um, Dra Dragonzord Titanus and Ultrazord. Uh, this Dragonzord review will be going up next, but I already did review the Tiger Zord, so Dragonzord will be doing a re-review as well. So. Both of these old videos are going to get deleted because those things need new videos badly. So, let's take this out of the way. Bring in the Megazord. So, I'm going to combine them in their dinosaurs first. Then we'll go from there. Put this tail down.
All right, though they here are the dinosaurs, guys. So let's start with the Triceratops. So here's the Triceratops. So the Triceratops is not bad. So um, there's no cannon, unfortunately. Um, I can tilt. Um, but it's pretty cool. The Triceratops is one of the favorite designs that I liked. Saber Tooth Tiger. <clears throat> so that's cool. Um, legs can only move so slightly. And can, can only tilt up. So it's pretty cool looking. Here is the Mastodon. So the head is gray, which is show accurate. Legs can only move so slightly. There's dogs barking downstairs. I'm sorry about that. I do apologize. Um, here is the Mastodon. I mean, a uh, pterodactyl. Um, head can only move so slightly on the... Wings can only flap. Oh, oops. No, I'll leave that there for now. And the Tyrannosaurus Rex. So, it's pretty cool looking, so... Legs can move. That can tilt up if you really want to. And so let's get into the tank mode, guys. So in order to do that, I'm gonna move these over here to the side. And there goes my. I'll fix it later. Um, let's get the Tyrannosaurus Rex all ready to go. Go in there. Really? There, finally. Oh my god. So there is the tank mode. So the tank mode is really nostalgic, guys. I like it, like it, like it, like it, like it, like it. So um, let's get into the Megazord mode. So uh, pop that off. Pop that off. Just to get it all ready to go.
basic Megazord sequence has been initiated. That was terrible. I sounded like a weird penguin. Basically, we're just gonna stand this dude up. He's standing, fun time standing. Don't punch the Megazord like an idiot like I just did. There we go, you guys. There is the Megazord. It is pretty nostalgic looking. I love it to death, so, um... Um, did I mention this is Zord Builder, so you can pretty much mix and match anything from the MMPR 2010 line through, uh, Samurai through Present, as well as the Legacy line. So, yeah. Um, that, this Megazord is pretty awesome looking. Um... Um, I do have the Black and Gold Megazord review, but that one has already been reviewed. Um, that one's not gonna get a re-review, but only the Dragon Zord and the, uh, Megazord will, so. If you wanna see the back. But, the reason being that my Megazord joints have always been loose. If I try to push them around... Look, he totally just tipped over. So, when I do the Dragon Zord review, it's going to be a pain, so, there's, that's the Megazord, you guys. Overall, I love this Megazord. It's been one of my all-time favorite Megazords growing up. If you want it, I think you guys should go get it. Catch you guys later. Peace, love, Zordon. It's more for time. I'll catch you guys later.